Today we are going to cover a case study on Power BI. Let's start. Like what are the difficulty level or advanced level to, to learn the Power BI? We need a decent understanding of business and reporting concept that we are building some reports in Excel or other tools already. We have some basic or beginner to intermediate level of Excel knowledge. If you want to be using Excel in Power BI, knowing thing can simply just fine. It will work out. And you need a passion to learn new thing. As a Power BI is a free tool and is similar as almost Excel. What are the objective of this course? You will learn about the Power Query. Power Query is used to extract the data uh, in Power BI. You will learn about the adding a calculated column and calculated majors and we will also see a different type of charts like waterfall charts line charts column charts other charts we will look into it and we will create a multiple report which represent a different scenario what we will learn in detail we will see power query the structure how to arrange the data we also see a filter and slice so and we will see a different type of chart in visualization screen. There are course requirement or prerequisites. You just need some basic knowledge of programming language and you have some passion or zeal to learn. Who are your target students? The target audience is analyst, a business and intelligent professionals, a report writer or storyteller, managers and executive, who need to build reports and a self-employed consultant. By the end of this course, you will have the following skill set. You will have a theory and concept as strong as many people in your organization wouldn't have. You would have a complete and a clear picture of the data which is falling inside your organization. You will have both technical as well as the business skill set, the blend of which is much needed in the organization always. What are the topic we will cover in this case study? We will explain what is Power BI. We will explain how to open the file and save the file. How to import a multiple file and append a data. Append means add a data. How to append, yeah, means extract data from a multiple files and clean it and create uh, import data from a single table single excel file and create a relationship we also see to create a table calendar table using a calendar dex formula and we will also see a calculate column in it to create a date table we'll also see how to use a dex majors we need for our visualization and table in our dashboard we will create multiple reports like average daily gross profit, fiscal report, average last 12 month and we will see how the report will change and uh, to after adding additional data and we will publish the report. What is the scenario? The scenario is the company needed a reliable tool to monitor her business sales performance and explore KPI from a different angle and time dimension. They need to quickly identify bad performing product, but the information at hand is limited. Static reports are rarely up to date. Her analysts do their best to mix and match template from their system and Excel file using VLOOKUP and INDEX MATCH. The manual work is extremely time consuming, each of which has to be updated weekly and only provide a narrow static view. And time to action is too long and problematic. Opportunities are very difficult to identify precisely. In this case study, we will cover the following scenario like how to import a data, clean it and transfer using a power query, create a DEX table, a date table using a DEX formula, create a relationship, uh, create a DEX major, hide an item, report query to refine data, we will see a dashboard, visualization table slicer in multiple tab and we, at last we will publish a report and you will see 
how we refresh the data.